Hi folks, um, this is Back to Basics Part 3. Um, you might notice when you first create a chart that you've got a uh, chart legend in the top right hand corner and then you know, you'll baffle your brain for a few hours figuring out how you can move it around. But if you press Control and Shift, you'll see you, uh, these little red lines appear. Um, so for example, we can shorten the uh, where the bars are. Um, if we click and drag the legend itself, you'll see when the, it kind of snaps to the top part. You can see that there, it's they let go. And then it will, um, it will kind of snap it to the top of the chart, which sometimes looks nicer than having it in the corner because you, need, you tend to need a, a wider chart for that. And again, you can click Control and Shift again and bring your bars just to below that line. And then that will allow for a, a nicer looking chart. Now you could select your chart again, but as you start moving it around, you will find it a little bit um kind of. If you drag this down, what will happen is it will bring the expression down. So again, drag it back up until you get the the result that you're looking for. Um, for example, we well, you don't want to do that. We click on a chart again, or the top piece, uh, the legend again. It won't let us do it, but if we select the chart and drag it over slightly, you can see this is where you run into problems. So depending on what part of the screen you drag it onto, you can lose the legend itself. So we snap that back to the top, and we get it back. So it can be a little bit finicky dealing with the chart legend, but again, control and shift is the one that you want to use um, to rearrange where you want to see this in your chart. And again, you can do the same with the, the, the bars themselves. So I hope that helps and I'll see you next video. Cheers.